everyone. I am I'm doing a new series at the moment. I'm still doing chain reaction, but I have been requested to do a couple of other episodes, so I'm going to post these as well. This in particular is called The Wolf Within. Now, if you guys want me to read something and post it, just request it. You know, I respond to all of my comments. So, you know, just tell me that you want to, you know, uh, me to read it. Okay, you guys, so I'm not even going to lie. I could, like, kind of read a little bit of this. So I'm just, like, replaying or whatever. I love it. I absolutely fucking love it. Okay. <clears throat> Let's start, y'all. I ran, ran, and ran. Dirt flying up as my claws dug into the earth. Each step pushing me towards the unknown future. I didn't know where I was going or if it was a place that I should be. All I knew was that my wolf's instinct was driving me to escape and run as far away as I could. And to make matters worse, I'm covered in blood, mud, and I'm completely worn out. I've been running for days, or maybe it's weeks now. Gosh, I need some rest. Girl, I, I <sighs> seriously doubt she's been running for fucking weeks and don't know how long she's been fucking running. Okay, whatever, girl. I couldn't run anymore, even though my wolf was telling me we weren't safe yet. I collapsed on the grass, breathing heavily. Wait, we yeah, are breathing heavily. Each breath of air stinging my lungs worse than the last. As I lay there, this in this unknown territory, not sure if this had been the right choice or not. Excuse me, guys. The trickle, the trickle of the lake. Lulled me to sleep in the distance. I could hear a, my wolf yelling and urging me to get up and run. Girl, nice ass house, girl. Love this house. I need to, I need to find this house in real life, girl. I need to see the inside of this bitch right here. Yeah. <laughs> so we need to figure out the details for the next meeting. Yeah, we do. Alpha, we have a situation. What's going on, dang? Morgan was scouting with some pack members and then came across a lone female wolf near the lake. Uh-oh, girl, they about to catch my ass. She also reports that this loner looks severely hurt. Are you sure? I've been known Morgan to lie about things she's found while scouting. He's right, honey. Morgan has never lied on her reports. Mm, I might not, but you better be a straight-A student, girl. <laughs> this is horrible. We have to see if she's all right. You're right, dear, but there may be more to this than just some lone wolf. Dang, get my son and meet us at the lake. Yes, Alpha. Let's go. I wish I could choose somebody. I want to be alpha. I want to be the female alpha, bitch. You know. I don't want to be a beta, bitch. Oh, my God. I want to be an alpha, girl. Moments before Dane had reported to the, uh, to the alphas about the lone wolf. Hi. What's in his room? Um... Reviewing some of the reports that his father had given him. His name's like... I like it. Um, He had a lot to go over. One of the perks of being the son of the Alpha. Soon his nose caught a scent. Roses. Pines. My mom has never smelled like this. It's so intoxicating. Kai. What is it, Dane? I'm a little busy here. We need to head down to the lake. A lone wolf has been spotted and is injured. Your parents are on their way. 
What? Let's go. This is giving me real Twilight fish. Growl. <laughs> Fucking growl. I can't believe I ran from one pack straight into another. Wait, straight into the territory of another. This is giving me real Twilight fish. I wouldn't be surprised if some vamps popped up, y'all. I'll definitely be killed if I'm caught. Nothing a pack hates more than a loner showing up on their territory. Excuse me, you guys. I'm like dead ass tired, y'all. Crap, there's no way to escape. Large rocks are surrounding me on every side. Oh, girl, no, no, girl, not you howling, girl. That scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I turned around and slowly began to back up when I saw four people stepping out from the woods. Growl. <laughs> that is cracking me up, girl. <laughs> growl. I got a low growl. Unfortunately, it came across as a nervous growl more than a fearsome growl. Mm. Loner, I suggest you shift back. Bitch, you, you ain't my alpha, huh? Well, <laughs> now I know who the alpha is. Unfortunately, I can't shift back, shift back even if I wanted to. Easy now, dear. She looks absolutely terrified. Look at how skinny she is. Girl, you poor thing. No, you poor thing, girl. Go for me, child. Sorry, you're right. Can you change back? I whined at his question. This isn't good. Who cares? She's a loner. We have to get her out of our territory. Julia girl, calm, calm your nerves. Fuck. Shut it, Julia. Thank you, Morgan girl. Shit. Oh, gosh. Whatever. Oh, that's the loner? <laughs> I let out. Another low growl, this time making sure I didn't sound terrified. I don't like this. Dang. It's fine, Alpha. Okay. Mmm. Kai, this smell is driving me nuts. <laughs> I want to know I need it. It smells like it's coming from over there. The loner must have run away as soon as the pack approached because they sure aren't by the lake can't believe that Dane didn't wait for me. Kai ran until he reached the um the rock gorge where some of his pack was. Okay. When he looked at the lone wolf standing with her hunches backed against the rock wall and Dane Closing in on her, Kai felt his, this urge to protect her and sh uh, shred anywhere apart that dared to touch her. Oh, God. Excuse me. Suddenly, a loud growl. <laughs> Revert. Uh, I don't know. Oh, shit. And it. A large growl, something in my mind, rock, something. Mine. Oh, okay, not yours, girl. That moment, everything went still and quiet. Dang, you touch her and so help me out. Kai's eye, eyes were the color of gold. Ah! <laughs> um, clearly showing that his wolf meant business. Dane whined, admitting to Kai... Oh, submitting to Kai, I said admitting, submitting to Kai, and walked away. Honey, calm down, no one's going to touch her. Kai, your mother's right, calm down. That loner is terrified, and you coming here huffing and puffing isn't going to help her. You're right, I'm sorry. Um, I watched their little banter until the guy named Kai turned around and looked at me. Crap, now he's approaching me. Ooh, shit, girl. 
I, I love how this is about wolves, but they don't even have like a wolf character, so it's just like imagination type shit. Growl. <laughs> this growl shit is stressing me out too. It's okay, I'm not going to hurt you. Growl, girl, growl, girl, growl again, girl. Easy, no, you easy, girl. I'm selling you back the fuck back, girl. <laughs> I looked at her and she backed away from me until she was as close to the rocks as possible. All right now, girl. I told you to back your ass up. I'm going to attack your ass, girl. The whole time, I wolf whining of sadness because she wouldn't let us approach her. I could understand that with the way she looks, she's too skinny. Uh, girl, y'all trying me, girl? And she's covered in blood. In mud. I'm going to growl, girl. I accidentally let a growl escape and instantly regretted it. She started to panic, shaking uncontrollably and trying to make herself look as small and unnoticeable as possible. Okay. I slowly reached out and tried to touch her. Uh, 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 come on. Crap, she bit me. Well, bitch, that's what you get. I done back growled at your motherfucking ass 15 times, girl. And you keep trying to touch me. I guess that's what I get for backing her up against the rocks. Well, girl, yes, that is what you get, girl. I shrank down instantly, regretting, <laughs> biting the sky. I may have just signed my death sentence. I closed my eyes, waiting for him to finish me off, but what I felt next completely shook me. Uh, two muscular arms surrounded me and carefully brought me into a hug. I panicked and tried to get free, but it didn't do me any good. He's only strengthened his hold on me. Sound real kidnappy, girl. It's okay. No one is going to hurt you here. Not if I have anything to say about it. I looked up at him and saw my saddened shape in the reflection of his eyes. Suddenly, everything started going dark. Oh, damn. Am I dying? N no, I can't be. We have to get her back to the pack, doctor. Now. Okay. I'll call him and have him meet us in the pack clinic. Come on, keep your eyes open. Kai, getting her to the clinic is our first priority, doc. We'll have a look at her with just for you guys. When we <laughs> Well then we can go from there, I think that's what they said. Um I soon felt like I was floating in the air, but it was really warm and felt safe. Safe that's a word I never thought I'd say. Soon after every sound and feeling left uh Left alone, stay with me. She went unconscious in the arms of another wolf. Her wolf yelling at her to fight the darkness. Code red, doc report to the OR. Damn, why can't I stop yarning? Uh, this is Alona that Alpha called in. Yes, sir, she's in really bad shape. Give her the shot to force her her transformation and then prep her for surgery doc there's no way she'll survive it we have no choice she'll die if we don't we have to risk it but no buts you want to tell kai that we didn't try to save her mm -mm, girl i'm getting a shot girl okay if you can hear me my dear this is going to be painful i felt myself floating in ovulation am i dead no i can't be um, I can still hear my wolf yelling at me to hold on. The next moment, a sharp pain started radiating through my body. My eyes shot straight open. Growl turns into an ah. Okay. Hold her down. Don't fight the change. As soon as you relax, the sooner it'll end. We're all ready. we will. <laughs> wow. 
I did my best to listen to the doctor. It wasn't too hard considering I ended up passing out again. Okay, girl. You real pass out, fish girl. <laughs> Growl. What are they doing to her? Guys, eyes turned golden again. Calm down. That's in order. <laughs> I'm going to talk to a nurse. Stay here. Girl, you real possessive fish. My father is right. I have to calm. Or I have to, to yeah, calm down. I close my eyes, take a few deep breaths, trying to calm both myself and my wolf. Okay, so y'all two different people. God knows he's a lot more wild up than I am. Okay. Well, y'all are. I take a few more breaths and remind myself that I can't do anything if I'm all hyped up. Kai, how is she? Looks like your eyes are back to normal. Are you calm? Yeah, sorry girl, how is she? What the hell? It's okay, I know that you're worried about her, but you're going to have to learn how to control that possessiveness of yours. You're right, girl. You're right. <laughs> uh, what did the nurse say? Actually, I talked to, to Doc. You talked to Doc? Yeah, she managed to survive the forced transformation in surgery. Wait, they forced a transformation in, in her condition? I know I'm not happy with it either, but that girl couldn't change back on her own. I take it that she isn't in the clear yet. That's right, Kai. That girl isn't in the clear just yet. Doc. Oh, damn. I think it said just his name. That girl is severely underway. And after a, a further evaluation, um, she's got bruises, cuts, and scars all over her body. She's she definitely looks like she's taking quite a uh, quite the beating, and it has no my bad. And it was definitely by another wolf. Growl. Okay, girl, what the fuck is that noise? Kai, sorry, it's fine. I understand how you feel. No wolf should be in this condition. As I was saying, her wounds were inflicted by another wolf. Although I'm not sure if it was done just by a single wolf or not. Some of the wounds appear pretty new and some fairly old. I say she's been treated like this for a while. But with her being severely underweight, it's hard to gauge how long exactly because her healing abilities are all but non-existent. Okay. How do you expect her to be here? Oh my bad. How long do you expect her to be here? Because I'm like, that didn't make no damn sense. Again, I'm um not sure we aren't uh sure when she will wake up or if she's even or if she even will. If she does wake up, our next action is to put some weight on her. I can barely see y'all. Uh, my damn eyes are watering on this damn yearning. We'll probably give her a shot of I don't know what the hell that says. Somebody serum. Do you realize how much pain she's going to be in if you give that to her? Okay. I'm sorry, y'all. I understand your concern, Kai, but we need to get her healing abilities to kick in. By giving her that serum, we can get... Oh, my man. <laughs> we can help give her wolf that extra help. She needs to recover. Can I go see her? Kai, I don't think yes, but only for a little bit. She needs to rest. Kai said, fuck what the fuck he was talking about, girl. He's going to go see his bitch. Are you sure? Yes, it's fine. Plus, I think seeing her will help calm that wolf of his. Ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably right. Sorry about my crazy son. It's fine. I'd be that way if I met my bond mate. And saw her in that state. Oh my gosh, who could have done this to her? I would, I could feel my wolf pushing at the surface, wanting to break free and unleash. 
Um, oh, wait a minute. Unleashes wrath. I think that was it. Was supposed to be his wrath on whoever did this to her. I don't know. Um, his nail starts to come out. Just breathe, Kai. Take a deep breath and calm down. Getting angry now. Is it going to help her? That's right. I had to get this possessiveness under control. I didn't know a, a mate bond a, could um, make you feel this way. Kai walked up to the side of the bed, sat down in the chair, and held her hand. He wasn't prepared to be in the wait, he was prepared to be in the seat for a while. Who is this who is this loner? Why is she covered in wounds? And what is a mate's bond? Find out in future episodes of The Wolf Within. Okay, that was pretty good. It was long. It was a nice little length. It was pretty good. I like it. So, if you guys want me to read other stories, just write it, you know, recommend them in the comments. I read all my comments, respond to them, all that. Um, So far, I have, uh, I think, like two or three stories that you guys want me to read. So, I just, this is one of them. And I will post this next episode, eh, probably, if not tomorrow, um, the day after tomorrow. Thanks for watching my video. Bye-bye.